Hi, I'm VC. Welcome to The Hue of Fun. And today we're going to be talking about my Disney honeymoon. Uh, so if you're wondering what's going on with my current look, um, huh, I've had a lung infection. So the plan was originally to come back from the honeymoon, have about a week's break and then get the vlogs out there. Um, so that right at the beginning of the Flower and Garden Festival, you could see what was going on. That did not happen. So we are here, a little bit late, but we are here. So we're going to hit the ground running today and talk a little bit about our travel days to Disney for mine and my husband's honeymoon and our first ever family holiday. So we began our trip on the 28th of February, 2023. Uh, went for two weeks in Walt Disney World, staying at Art of Animation, and we came back on the 15th of March of this year. So we, you know, it's, we've only been back just over a month. So the night before our flight, we stayed at the Leonardo London Heathrow Airport Hotel. It's 95 pounds for the night. And as you can see, we had a really lovely sized room. We have no idea what this vent was for though. It doesn't, it doesn't go anywhere, look. There's nothing on the other side vent to nowhere in the bathroom. Um, but the bathroom was a very good size, lovely bit of artwork there. And as you go through to the bedroom, there was a really nice amount of storage. Uh, we had access to an iron and a hairdryer and, and sort of all the amenities you need. There's a little coffee station and a desk. Um, the beds were lovely made, uh, but we jumped in them already. And that is Minnie Rich's bed as well pretty jazzy walls too. Mini wrench out for the count at the end of the day. So the next morning we were up bright and early. We had to be there at the airport for 7 a.m. Um, we had a really easy pre-check-in and then we went and found this amazing play area. Uh, I was able to film in this area because there was no other families or children present. Um, we had the place all to ourselves. So there was a baby and um, older child play area, lots of soft play toys. Uh, they had CBBs on the TV playing as well. Um, and as you see, Mini Ranch just having a great time. Cute little art gallery of people's pictures. And inside here is a sensory room. So if your little one's getting a bit overwhelmed, uh, this was a really lovely quiet space um, with projections and soft play toys boys having a little sleep there and this amazing LED uh, touch display we had great fun with that I found these bins really fun kind of whimsical this was the baby changing room and then just across the hallway as well there was a nursing room if you want some privacy while breastfeeding uh, mini wrench loved these cars we didn't get to go on one and then we were on our way up in the skies. The food was really good uh, on the flight. This is the adult meal. Uh, this is the child's meal. I will say the child's meal was the same on the way back as well. There wasn't any variation there. And this is the afternoon tea we had towards the end of the flight. Uh, we fly Virgin Atlantic Economy Delight and I would thoroughly recommend it for the extra leg room. The staff on board are really friendly and they definitely kicked off our honeymoon celebrations with a bang. Uh, Join me next video where we look at arriving at the Art of Animation Resort, having a little look around, and our first day at Magic Kingdom where my husband and son get their first look of the Disney castle. I've been VC for the Hue of Fun and I'll see you then.